Welcome back everyone and happy Tuesday as you're heading out the door this morning. You might notice it's a little chilly similar to yesterday. Great Falls actually has tied for its record cold that was set back in 1909. So this is the coldest temperature we've had on this morning since 1909 17 degrees kind of chilly out there. It's a little bit warmer in the capital city this morning. We have a little bit more cloud cover. It's 30 degrees right now in Helena, so a little warmer closer to the freezing point, but still below freezing this morning. Chilly start across the state in Montana. Other folks across the country getting some active weather this morning. If we zoom in here around the plains, there's uh, rain and snow, a mix of everything. And off to the east, kind of towards the Midwest, there's some pretty strong thunderstorms kind of ramping up for today. But in Montana, really the only active weather area is around Billings. There's a little bit of snow kind of along I-90 here. But for the entire state, that is really the only spot getting active weather this morning. North Central Montana is much quieter, although still pretty chilly out there. Now we do have a chance of some showers rolling in later on today, but that's really going to be concentrated in southeastern Montana where there is this winter weather advisory in the purple here around Billings and a winter storm warning for the highest elevations. Um, but the rest of the state, although we do have a chance for some showers, it's not going to be anything severe. So nothing like the blizzard conditions that we saw on Sunday. So for the rest of the day, you'll notice that really picking up later on around the afternoon time, early afternoon into the early evening hours. So you'll notice that's just kind of some light showers rolling through and that's going to stay predominantly in the higher elevations, especially um, around Helena. So in the mountains around town tomorrow, that's going to kind of continue with another chance of showers kind of rolling through. But in the lower elevations, that should just be rain, snow in the higher elevations, not a huge amount. And when it comes from our west like that, you notice uh, the systems really tend to dry out as they move over the mountains. So we shouldn't get a whole lot of accumulation from that on Wednesday into Thursday, although it's just going to stay kind of gloomy, kind of overcast here throughout the next couple of days. Now you'll notice the main uh, snowfall accumulation really off in the southeastern portion of the state where that winter weather advisory and winter storm warning have been issued. The rest of the state is going to stay fairly quiet. The mountains getting a little bit more accumulation than the lower elevations, but just going to mainly be kind of gloomy out there for the rest of this week. Today, similar to yesterday for those afternoon highs, looking at low to mid 40s for the afternoon today, and we're going to stay fairly cloudy as we have that active weather moving through. Although most folks aren't going to see a huge amount of snowfall, it is going to stay pretty cloudy and cool for today. So still going to need a jacket out there, especially this morning. Temperatures are pretty chilly out there. Check out the seven day forecast. So you'll notice today through Thursday really going to be kind of that unsettled showery and cloudy weather. Friday, though, looking like the gem of the seven day here. Saturday and Sunday, not so much, but Friday, that's the day I've got my eye on. I guess we've all got our eye on Friday. It's Tuesday. It's the hardest day of the week here, but Friday looking nice. Saturday, Sunday, next round of wintry weather coming through for the first weekend of May. I wish that wasn't the news I had to tell everyone, but mm. Monday looking nice again. So hopefully heading into next week, we'll look at some drier and warmer weather for the first full week of May. Yeah, let's hope for that. Yeah. But Friday and Monday then. All yeah. right, we can have some nice things still too <laughs> like that. All right, thanks, Katie.